Hey game devs, here's the next Unity tutorial for beginners and it's about Unity events. Let me demonstrate this using my low poly game kit and the conversation system. So for example the task could be to play an animation when the conversation starts. For instance we could add this to our conversation trigger script that starts a conversation when the player is entering a trigger. The animation that I want to play I created with Blender, it is a very simple talk gesture. I added this animation to the animator controller of the player. And I also added a trigger called tr underscore talk to start it. I added a talk method to the player controller script to set this trigger. Ok, so let's open the conversation trigger script and add a unity event. The event has to be public, the type is unity event and I call this on conversation start. Ok, and when the conversation starts I just have to invoke this unity event. That's really all you have to do to provide this Unity event. And in the editor, in the inspector, you can see this on conversation event now. And to actually do something when it is invoked, we have to press this plus icon to add a game object that we want to use then. The game object is the player, I just drag it here into the slot and I want to call the method talk. To do this, open the drop down and search for the talk method of the player controller script. And now when the conversation is started, the talk animation will be played. Ok, but that's not all, you can now go ahead and add more objects, more handlers for your Unity event. So what could we do for example, we could add a crate and open it. The only thing you have to do is to drag the object, the crate, into the slot and search for the method on interact which will open it. Alright, we could also add one of those candles and deactivate the game object to turn out the light. For this we don't have to write a custom script, it is a built-in behavior to deactivate a game object. Just open the drop down again, find game object and set active and keep the checkbox unchecked. Then I hit play to start the game and when the conversation is started, the character animation is played, the box is opened and the candle is deactivated. Ok guys, I hope you find this tutorial useful and if you do, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you'd like to support me, think about being my patron, this would really help a lot. And if you have any questions or feedback, add it to the comments below. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you on JNM.